I teach behaviors with food. And because he's very motivated for the ball and to play tug, I train behaviors with the ball and the tug. So I teach the behavior first. Once the command is, once the behavior is on command, then I tell him to do the behavior and I reward him with the ball. So I'm not going to really feed him with food today, only because he'd feel ripped off if I gave him food, because he really wants this ball that's in my pocket. But I'm going to tell him to do a few things. And we're just going to practice just a two minute training session to kind of see how I can give him fulfillment in, in a typical session. So the first reward that I gave him was just access to the ball, drop, yes. and then the second marker that I've given here is now to play the game tough. So, drop, yes, mess up. So you can see here that he really, really wants this, and I have to make him work for it. Now doing this for five, seven minutes, he is so gassed. That I would finish, we continue our walk, he does a couple of peas with a freeze, drink some water, we come back home and he relaxes. When you're done, when you're training the dog, before putting it away, finished, I tell him we're done, you can see now that he knows that the session's over. He's gonna go back to the shade and relax. Now, 